Yo, y'all don't even know what's happening. Niggas is know the vibes. You know it's Liddy already. I'm recording a video, nigga, it's lit. Basketball season has returned, kinda. You still got like three weeks left. I think, it's like, some, it's like something like that. Three, four weeks left. Who knows, bro, but it's back. NBA predictions video for the 2018, 2019 season. This really, really early because we haven't actually seen these players play at all. So you really don't know what's gonna happen. That's why it's a predictions video. So the first one on my list, I got the MVP. You know I gotta go with my boy, Braun, you feel me? I have to go with Braun because, bruh, his whole career, he been in the East. He began to the playoffs. He began to the finals. It's easy money, you feel me? Niggas been like, yo, it don't even matter because the East, it, you feel me, it's light. But on the West, though, if, bro, he, okay, look at the Browns team right now. Like, they got some, like, I, I mess with the young core. Like, I mess with Brandon Ingram, uh, Kuz, um, Josh Hart, Lonzo. But, like, they really don't got, like, like if Paul George had went there or, like, Kawhi had went there, yeah, then we could be, like, ah, right, Lakers is definitely, like, a top three, like, seed in the West. But, like, it's just LeBron there. Bro, if he even gets him to a fourth seed, dog, just right there of that. Just off getting into a fourth seed, bro. That's MVP status right there. Rookie of the year. You got my boy, the young boy. You got my son. But I don't know if there's any space on the side of him, but like, uh, like them transparent pictures. I don't know if I got a space. But we got my boy, Colin Sexton. Yo, that nigga, he better than Michael Jordan on some real shit. It's like, nah. But nah, Colin Sexton, a dog, bro. So think about it. LeBron left. It's really Colin Sexton's team. Because the only, like... Kevin Love, they finna trade that nigga. That nigga finna be out of there in like three months anyways. I think so, I think so. Bruh, D-Wade, 2005 season. Like, go research that season. That's gonna be Colin Sexton this year and like years to come. Like, I feel like he got that, bro. Nigga is a dog, bro. Rookie of the year, bro, I promise you. MVP in 10 years, Colin Sexton. You know I'm jacking that right now. So next up on the list, we got defensive player. I'm going with Kawhi. Giannis or like Draymond, cause Draymond really a dog. That nigga really be guarding all five positions, bro. Y'all really sleeping on that nigga, bro. Y'all really sleeping on that nigga. So yeah, defensive player, I really don't got a player, but I got Kawhi, Giannis, and Draymond. It's gonna be one of them three, bro. Most improved. I know Lonzo is a second year player, and like second year players really don't be getting like most improved. Just cause you go from a rookie season to your second year, you should improve because that's how it works. Lonzo is really a pure point guard, bro. So look at all his bro. He got Kuz, he got Braden Ingram, he got Lance, he got LeBron. So his is bro. This nigga damn near had a triple double every single game. That nigga is a beast, bro. I'm telling you, bro. This year I've been seeing he been in the gym. When his shot goes up, all right. My sleeper team. The Oklahoma City Thunder, bro. Son. And for sleeper team slash sleeper person, I'm saying Russell Westbrook. Because, bro, y'all really be violating this nigga, bro. Like, Russ came in the ring. Russ came in games. Nigga, Russ went to the finals before. He was dead as one game from the finals. When they was up 3-1 on the Warriors, bro. And them niggas, him and KD, I don't know what they was doing, bro. Son, even Russ um, last season against the Jazz... He was keeping them in the games, and I think they only won like two games. But niggas be violating Russ, talking about he's not a team player, son. He is a team player, I promise you. You don't be watching the games. Like, niggas be like, okay, he averaged 10 assists a game, but he a ball hog. My nigga, like, is no t 10 assists, bro. That shit is not easy to get. Y'all niggas is. And they, bro, Paul George came back. Now, Paul George by himself, he not like, he not like a top dog, but pair him up with someone else. Like, if he had went to the Lakers, him and LeBron. You know what I'm saying? But him and Russ, dog, that's like the perfect, um, stop sleeping, bruh. My conference finals teams. For the East, I got the Celtics and 76ers. And on the West, I got the Warriors and the Lakers. Now, for the East, you might say Kawhi is on the Raptors now. But if you really think about it, like, the Raptors really didn't get anyone. They just got Kawhi and Danny Green. The, the rest of the team is the same squad from last year. And then niggas got set by LeBron. It's really just gonna be Kawhi, Danny Green, and Kyle Lowry doing whatever he doing. But they really don't got a depth like that. Like the Celtics, son. Jason Tatum, um, Jalen Brown, and then they got Gordon Hayward. That's just a three position. Like, that's just a three and two. And like the point guard position is deep. Um, 
like I said, the two and three is deep, the four, the like they really the deepest team in the NBA right now. Like the 76ers, I just gotta say two names, bruh. Uh I forgot their names. Hold up. Joel Embiid and Ben Simmons. Warriors Lakers for the West. Uh Warriors. I feel like they're a lock just because it's the Warriors. And I say the Lakers. Like the Lakers, I feel like they're actually like really deep. Like they got Alonzo at the one. They got um Rondo's experience, you feel me? LeBron. Brandon Ingram really gonna be a problem soon. Kuz is already a problem. Josh Hyatt, I don't really know too much about him. I know he different though. There's two scenarios for the finals. And in both scenarios, the Celtics come out on top. So I got see the Lakers and Celtics or Warriors and Celtics. Like I said, Celtics are deep. For the Western Conference Finals, it could really go both ways because, bruh, someone could get injured, someone could have off games, you feel me? It's, a lot can go into it. But just niggas, let me know. Just let me know if I was bugging out on my shit because I really feel like my shit was really accurate except for saying, like, Colin Sexton is better than Michael Jordan. But that's just because Colin Sexton is so good, you can't really compare him to someone like Michael Jordan. What? That nigga's tripping. Shaking my head.